Hi, my name is Dr. Surekha Tiwari. I'm a practicing homeopathic doctor and a psychological counselor. I practice in Bangalore and I have two clinics, one in HSR and one is in ACS layout. Tingling sensations in hands and feet. It's a very generic symptom and it can have lots of causes. Let's not get into the neurological bit of it because first we will rule out what are the very generic causes. But the first thing is you must have also realized that when you're sitting with your folded legs for too long, your feet start tingling or what you say, the leg becomes numb. So the first and the foremost reason for tingling can often be blood circulation. If the blood circulation is not proper, then also you will have tingling sensations. And because the fingers and the toes, they've got very small capillaries. So they are the ones which will show you the symptoms first. When you go somewhere cold, these are the first things will become cold. The same thing is when the blood circulation is low, they are the first ones to show you symptoms of certain coldness. So that's the first thing which we all need to remember that we will take care that the blood circulation is looked on by moving every few minutes. Getting up and moving every few minutes, that will help you. The second reason for tingling of toes and all this can be vitamin B12 deficiency. Vitamin B12 deficiency is often found in many reports to be very deficient in very many people these days. It's basically because of our dietary habits. So may not be a bad idea to include green leafy vegetables and dairy products in your diet. Having said that, done that and you still feel there is a tingling, then please do go for a test of B12 first and find out if there is a deficiency which is not repairable only by food and you may need to switch on to supplements. And the third reason of this is neurological disorders. Now that on this forum need not be discussed. If you find that the first two conditions have been looked after by you, you have looked after your B12, you've looked after your activity and still the tingling and the burning remains, then please approach your doctor. He should be checking out for diabetes and he should be checking out for any neurological disorders. Once the diagnosis is done, treatment is easy.